I, I, That's I'm, okay with you? Know, you? Yeah. Right. I don't care if people like Obama. It's, uh, you know, it's their problem. I made that up. Um, oh, thank you. Uh, Chuck in Boston. And I feel better. <laughs> I was going to start rooting for the Phillies. <laughs> What's up, Chuck? Hey, good morning. Uh, I've got your political update from Boston. Boston. Yes. Well, guess who's mayor today of Boston? Yeah, Mayor Menino won a fifth term. He did it, man. Fifth term. Now, Anthony and I got kicked out of Boston Jesus. 11 years ago. Believe it or not. It seems like yesterday, but we haven't done radio uh, in the city itself in 11 years. Mm-hmm. And when we got there, Mayor Menino was already the mayor. Mm-hmm. He yeah. sucks. It's been there forever. It's amazing. Forever. What, what's going on up there? Mm-hmm. We got some Mayor Menino talking about uh, his win. You oh, really? Hear you sure? Beautiful. Please. Hey, Chuck, thank you, buddy. You're welcome, bud. Chuck in Boston. Uh, Menino talks about what comes next for Boston. Tonight, <laughs> as we stand here, yeah, you guys keep believing. Tonight, it. as we stand here yeah, you, on a farm, <laughs> you guys keep in Boston. You guys keep believing in your politicians. That's oh, okay. God. They're cartoon characters. This motherfucker. And get Bloomberg uh, sounding a, a bit swishy. I want to hear some of that. <laughs> Tonight, as we stand here. <laughs> Filled with energy for what comes next, we're reminded again that our city, more than three centuries old, still changes every day. Today, somewhere in Boston, a teacher taught a child to read. Shot an entrepreneur. Teach a child a, sh- shot a child. What? <laughs> what is he saying? An entrepreneur. <laughs> Somewhere in Boston, a teacher taught a mayor how to read today. That's nice. <laughs> Nothing. <laughs> well, maybe I should have gave it a second and hope for the best. An entrepreneur started a novel business. A neighbor welcomed a new Bostonian. A doctor pioneered a new therapy. Before they started the day, or after they came home, they went to the polls. <laughs> Whoever they voted for, they voted to reinvent our city yet again. Reinvent? Re- yet again? What? By putting you back in there? Get to reinvent our city yet again with me again. Re- reinvent? <laughs> yes. <laughs> what the fuck? Unbelievable. Boston's a cool city too, man. Well, I like I like a little Boston. Check I guess in there's my nothing life. terrible going on in Boston though. Like as but, much as the guy's a blithering idiot, the city runs. I mean, it's yeah. just amazing though that no one can come up from, from the ranks mm. and take him out. Yeah. Nah. Yet again, the headlines may read that today we're learn we're elected <laughs> to a fifth. What the fuck are you saying? How are you not good at this yet? <laughs> yes. Yeah, it's not like you just got into office. He didn't just get the gig. <laughs> He's been there for fucking ever. Okay, Big A does the news better. <laughs> 16 years he's been in that office. How does he not know how to talk publicly after all this practice? Wow. I had to back that, that up a bit. Yeah, I want Listen to again. I realize my read that today we're, learn- we're elected to a fifth... Historic term. Historic term, idiot. Holy shit. You've not been elected to a fifth historic term. It's not like you had one historic term after another. Yeah, yeah, another. It's a historic fifth term. You (laughs) fucking wrong order putting words in fucking whole ass. (laughs) Yes. <laughs> you have to be a good public speaker if you're going to be a politician. Oh, my God. I think you just have to. Yeah. What the fuck? It continues. Thank God. We got a couple more clips from Menino. <clears throat> Let's be clear. <laughs> we haven't made history with this election, but we will. What we create of it. <laughs> what, is it? what does that even mean? Like... Spoken properly, what would that even mean? You know, like a like a good glass of wine, 
I like to take my time with this audio and yeah. savor it. Yeah. Just kind of enjoy it. Yeah. Swish it around in our mouths a little bit like yeah. he does with his fucking tongue. Wait, of it. Oh, wait. I want to hear that of it again. Oh, of it. Hold on. Sorry. Mm-hmm. But we will. What we create of it. When we have provided a new Boston miracle for our kids. I, I don't even know what that. a new urban. I don't even know what that. What, what, is, miracle? what did he say there? We provided a new Boston miracle for our kid. You got provided out of it? I, I think so. Very good. Very good for you. Miracle for our kids. Design a new urban mechanics for our city. Build one shared future out of our diverse backgrounds. Let them write the record books then. The record books? We put our residents in jobs, residents. shops, and vacant spaces. Residents. Students through college. And the city has a physical downturn. Physical. Have then, people talking in the background. Let's talk yeah. about history. Ah, let's. Fucking Holy idiot. babbling idiot. It's amazing. What a buffoon. We have one more clip if you'd like to hear it. Please. Yeah? I wish we had more. Uh, let me say hi to Jack in South Carolina. Jack? Hey, boys. Happy hey. birthday, everyone. Hello, Especially sweetie. Especially you. Uh, what's your name? Hey, uh, listen. Oh. Um, <laughs> if, 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 I don't know if it's the sound quality or anything like that. But he sounds just like Archie Bunker sitting in a chair after about a six pack of beer. Hey. He just, you know, he's like, ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. And then all you need is an Edith Bunker or something. Give me a beer, Edith, and shut up, meathead. <laughs> <laughs> what a anyway, blithering idiot. That's all I have to offer. Thank Sorry. you, sir. It was a lot. Much. Oh. No, it was a good <laughs> observation. Wes, uh, the trucker, Wes. Hey, boys. Hey. Uh, super quick. Uh, I like how George Bush would say one word wrong and just get crucified, uh, crucified uh -huh. in the media. And then, uh, <laughs> yeah. And then uh, this guy can't even talk for the past however many years and no one says shit about it. That's true. I mean, I understand Bush was the president, so that's a, another level up from a uh, mayor, obviously. But uh, just no one says nothing about this guy. Yeah, the media up there in Boston, they pretty much leave him alone. I mean, there's a few guys, I guess they take a little shot here and there, but... It's amazing they just let him just babble like this and, yeah. and, and don't bring it up as a very obvious thing. He, he, he can't speak. Well, they, he the can't. Go ahead. No, so the media treats that kind of the way they should. Like, it really doesn't matter. A little mis He's just not a great speaker. Like, it, it almost is like, as much as he's an idiot, the fact that he's not a good speaker and keeps getting elected is, is you got to kind of like that. Like, I guess. They attacked Bush for making mistakes, and yet when John Kerry... Who was running against him would make do certain words he couldn't say. They called it a verbal misstep. Misstep. Yeah. It was amazing how like the times and stuff would would softly word it for him, and yet Bush was a blithering idiot. Yeah, right, right. Let's say hi to Randy. Randy. Yeah. What's up, Randy? How you doing, guys? All right, Randy. Hey, you know those are the people who cheer, and I really uh, people who elected him. Those are all his uh, special education teachers. Burr, burr. <laughs> uh, that's, that's it for me. <laughs> it certainly is. All right, one more clip from Mayor Menino. Uh. The stories may say that today we beat our toughest opponent. But we haven't passed the biggest obstacle yet. My tongue. <laughs> Complacency is the highest hurdle we face. Let us fend off the temptation to rest on past accomplishments <laughs> or to walk in familiar paths. When we do, them them, them rape. <laughs> Only then. What did he, he say, say right there? Yeah, them them rape. Them them rape. It's not like rape. he said them them rape. <laughs> them 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 rape. <laughs> That's a hell of a platform to run yeah, on. Yeah, what the fuck? I didn't I think I didn't, he I wants don't... everyone to rape. I'm not really heard, sure. I'd have heard about this one. <laughs> really? <laughs> them them rape? Should that be on the front page? Yeah. Mayor Menino encourages everyone to rape any rape rape. rape. Them them rape. To walk in familiar paths. When we do. Them, them, them rape. Only then. Let them rape? Then we can't what? overcame. Can't overcame. Our strongest chance. Then we can't overcame. Did he just say can't overcame? He, can't overcame? he is a disaster. Yeah. Then we can't overcame <laughs> our strongest challenges. 
Our victory today is not a trophy to put on a shelf or to parade on a duck boat. <laughs> it's not a championship, but a chance. Oh, it's an opportunity to improve our neighbors' lives, to bring the city together, and to move it forward. Oh, he stinks. We are going to need all our strengths, all 600,000 of us. He literally says nothing that is sincere. No, it is no, all no. political hack lie. Mm -hmm. We must concentrate on doing good, not bad. Yeah. Shut up! <laughs>